Bloody hell. All right, guys, out. Oh, fuck. Can't believe you've done this. Someone walking past cringe. Oh, no. I can't even hide because of this new GoPro. Way out. All right, guys, how's it going? Welcome back. So today I'm doing something outrageous, something crazy. Driving all the way to Manchester. Manchester! I know it's not quite Manchester. It's Hyde for those people that live near there and go, it's not quite Manchester. It sounds better for the title if I say Manchester. I'm driving to Manchester to try Syndicate Sunset Special Burger. He announced that you can now go and get a Syndicate Sunset Special Burger. Now, it's a place called... Limefield Garden Centre. I'm doing a voiceover because I called it Ryefield Hacker Butchers. Like, I think it's a farm, cafe, garden centre kind of vibe. And it's not on the menu. It's a secret menu thing. So you have to ask for them. You have to be like, hey, boss man, you got the uh, Syndicate Sunset Special, fam. I believe it's a burger that consists of a patty, believe it or not, bacon, cheese, ketchup, lettuce, tomato, and a bun, I think. But either way, I thought it'd just be sick for a video. You know, I love Syndicate's content. Well, Tom's content. His vlogs are absolutely sick. And he's been in inspire me for years literally like kind of got me kind of getting into youtube like oh, well i used to do gaming back in the day this is this is not what the video is about anyway yeah i thought it'd be sick to drive down there and try and i think it's i was saying i want to do these bigger better videos and here i am driving like it's about three and a half hours to manchester to try a burger let's do it man i'm excited Bash. oh yeah also i'm recording on a gopro doesn't it look sick gopro hero 11 pro i think got it from argos i'm gassed oh this fuck Fuck you, Kurt. I'm gonna just get on my knees. That Side. sounds nuts. I need to remember this is a segment, not a unboxing of a GoPro. <laughs> Comes in a case, I never knew that. I never knew that. Imagine it was just the case. <laughs> Got the smell. Why is it coming off like that? I'm just gonna scratch it straight away, aren't I? Why is it? We're getting there in this tin can piece of shit. Right, I'm gonna put it in my phone. Uh, usually I would have a phone mount over here. Basically, I've broken like three of them. I don't know if I'm heavy handed or they're just shit. It might be a bit of both, but three hours and 47. It was like three hours. Oh, well, tomato, time. tomato, it's all the same. It just depends what time of day you go. That's the route, bro. Wait, so, well did I tell you to speak? By the way, I'm going with my sister. But don't stop being a fucking 12 year old. Just oh. say hello. Hello. So yeah, I'm gonna have to make do. My cousin did this a couple years back. Because it's so far and I've never driven to Manchester. I've been in a van to Manchester for like an hour once. I don't, don't even think I got out of the van for a job I used to do. But yeah, I've not actually driven there myself. So I've got to be on it. I've got to be listening to this. Turbo whip. I don't know why I'm giving you an update. We're like 20 minutes, half an hour in, I guess. AC doesn't work. Like it hasn't since I got the car. It's fine in the winter, but like even like, you don't really want to crack a window when you're in the car on the motorway. It's just ear rain. You can see we're going into the, uh, the lovely rain by the looks of it. Apparently it's raining in, Man in, in Manchester today. Oh shit, it's now pissing it down. Shiver my timbers. This whole strip of motorway is 80 miles. Fuck me, man. I hope it's not three hours of this. UK weather, ladies and gentlemen. What what service is this? Sherwell Valley. Mate, this shot's sick, man. Mate, this wide is sick. As you can see, I'm still trying to get comfortable with actually recording out and about. Again, compared to like four or five years ago, I'm way better, but sausage roll, bro. Come on. Red Bull. Thank you to the services. It was really good, innit? Subscribe. Mm. Served us really well. Yeah, this is way more discreet though with this GoPro. <laughs> Vlogging the experience, traveling there and that, you know? Let me just say quick, this sausage roll was the best like packed sausage roll I've ever bought from a supermarket. It might have been M&S, but it was banging. Smash it. I thought I'd eat something before because we still were like two and a half hours. We would have stopped off probably a bit later on, but because we've not eaten anything. Five quid. All right, back on the road. Fuck the fucking map apps. Fuck up, man. Well, at least we can turn around there. It's not past that behind, but I thought it passed by in like 20, 30 minutes, but thankfully it hasn't. Landscape, I don't know, but uh, go get in the shot. Hey, we're like, I don't know how long we've done, hour and 45, two hours. We've now got hour and 58 apparently, but we're on this M42, I think. And we keep going, stopping, going, stopping. I think it's gonna be like this for another fucking nine miles, if you can see there. It's like red, yellow. Even this side's fucked by the looks of it. Look, look where, we, I don't know what this is like a toll station. What the reason is for it, let me know in the comments. I thought this was the kind of shit you get like before you go into Wales and that, not from London to Manchester. And they make you pay cheeky fuckers, That's man. I'll be 59 pounds, so. 
do our own video recording in operation. Same here, Shen. <laughs> Just do a smithy and break the barrier. Will you be arrested? Ah, go! You have been cleared the card. In the card, read a slot below. Oh, it takes you like that. Look at it go open. Right, this is weird seeing this. It's all just open. Oh, I'm shaking! Family. I don't know what this bridge is. It's sick to be fair, that's a lovely bridge. Yeah, apparently Hyde is like Greater Manchester, so Manchester, Hyde, whatever. It, Manchester's still going in the title, it just sounds better, but we are very nearly there. I was saying to my sister, I feel like achy and just fucked, you know? It's a car like this, a little, a little Nissan Micro. You guys saw the fucking, the epicness of the car. It's very nice driving through like a different town or city that you've never actually really been to. Here we go guys, Limefield. Let's try the Syndicate Sunset Special. Why do I just have a feeling that they're just not gonna have it or something? Honestly, yeah, it's so it's bad. Right. It also feels like we're not supposed to be here. I don't know why. Where do we park, bro? I need a oh. stretch, man. Come on in. Oh, it's lovely, mate. Oh, it smells so much fresher as well. It's probably cheaper as well. I wouldn't be surprised if it was like five quid, to be honest. All right, so I just want to say a few things quick. First of all, my OCD is screaming at me because I'm not quite central of the GoPro. And also, where my sister was, it looked way better because she had actually had light in front of her. She had the window, so I really wish I was sat where she was, at least next time I now know. I had to do some color correcting because it did look pretty shit. So this is what it looked like before. This is what it looks like after it's not too bad it kind of helps and yeah obviously just I'm, I'm still getting used to recording out and about so what you'll see is not me like being oh yeah guys so we're here eating this and that um, and yeah also i wasn't sure if i was at the right place i was trying to figure it out like i was looking around and stuff hi there you're right yeah i'm drink yeah i'll get a coffee uh i'll get a latte please and do you just order the food now yeah cool? you want, yeah, yeah. Ready. um have you got that secret menu item that yeah, of course. Yeah. Nice one. Sweet. Didn't know if I was at the right place, but yeah, I am. <laughs> For some reason, I couldn't bring myself to like ask. I imagine if it was the wrong place, and I was like, "The Syndicate Sunset Special." <laughs> also, I probably would have butchered it anyway. Sorry, what was the answer again? It's gone right. Uh, latte, please. Yeah. Actually, yeah, we'll get some water as well. Yeah, sure. Okay. Cheers. Mate, I literally really thought I was at the wrong place. Really nice view, so who needs a tripod, bro? You, because you're lopsided, your mother. Um, Thing is, how long is this going to record for? I don't think it's going to be that long. Uh, we've been served. Yeah, thank you. Uh, yeah, we've got. We've been served. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Oh, mate, they're, they're, they're on it though, it's good. Mate, I don't know how good this battery is on here. How long is it gonna last? Sorry guys, I'm still getting used to being able to actually speak on the camera. I'm a bit shit at it, so. Mate, I think I think they were looking at the menu to make sure that it's like proper. Hi, right, mate, thank you. Okay, so, secret burger and... Yeah, what do you want now, Can I get a roast ham and cheese toast sandwich? Ham and cheese toast, And you want to get them fries? Can we get bread and fries and cheese sandwich? Yeah. Okay. I think there's some wedges that come on with the burger, right? Yeah. Uh, we'll be fine then, just leave it, yeah. That's okay. Yeah, thank you. This latte is sick. It's coming like a glass. It's professional, huh? It's Manchester water, bro. I seen gas when I ordered it, which is nice. I need to drink this coffee before the four hour drive. Yeah, we should buy something. Mate, that's quite pretty nice. I would tip it. Can I have a bite of it, please? Like no. So what I rate as well, they've actually got numbers, they've got staff. They know that I'm getting it, they know the camera's there. So it's like, they're just gonna watch me eat it. Even though I do eating videos, I would be like, oh. But again, Amy, it's advertisement. The thing is, I don't even think they sell burgers here, do they? No, I don't think they do. I'll put the menu up on screen here, guys. Nice, nice uh, environment, though. Eh? It is overall cheaper too, I think. Well, I saw a Jack and Potato, 9 95 <laughs> yeah, That's definitely the burger sizzling, I can hear it. It's gonna be big, by the way, this burger. Bloody hell. Uh, yeah, just there. Thank you very much. Damn, Sam. This is thick, bro. Also, fuck knows why I didn't get a shot of it on my phone. I really don't know. Again, just anxiety. That coleslaw looks nice. Mate, the way the, the sauce is oozing out, that's sick. I don't even know where to start, to be fair. Yeah, fuck off if you think that's going to make the thumbnail. That's right, I mean, I'm, mate, that patty's so big as well. That bacon's crispy too, you can feel it. Will you want to bite as well? God, look at all that juice dripping out. Subscribe. Hey, in that good. Oh, mate, suck a that. Oh, mate, that's lame. Also, that coleslaw in there would be even better. I've only just had a bite, but that's like proper steak. Yeah, I believe they said it was brisket. I've uh, used uh, brisket there, uh, just off the, off the four part because it's a bit of fat in it. Yeah. Give the burger a bit of consistency, a bit of. Oh my gosh. I <laughs> really think about people watching me. Even when I do eating videos, it shouldn't matter. Also, I find it easier eating burgers like this. I don't know yeah, what. No, I do, do you know what I mean? Yeah. 
Mm. That is lame, man. Also, that's quality ingredients as well. I think it's like a butcher's as well, farm. So you're getting proper, legit, fresh, non-processed meat. Seasoned with like rosemary or something. Do you want a wedgie? Yeah, please. Do you want to buy this? I'm right for now. I'm just trying to figure myself out. I'm making such a mess. Even at home, I wouldn't give a fuck. Ooh. I'm try this coleslaw. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that patty's got a very decent amount of protein. You've got to make them all the same size, so we're about 160. 160 gram oh, patty oh. is saucy. It's like the proper buns you get in America as well. Yeah, I rate these proper legitimate buns because it actually held the burger together, whereas sometimes you get like a soggy bottom and then the burger's just fucked. People are just chilling, just having a coffee, and I'm here just the scran in a burger. I think you can get it to take home as well. If you want to get all the ingredients for making it at home, you can just go in there and get it yourself. Very nice. When it's messy, it's even nicer with the bacon I rate. It's like proper crispy bacon. Yeah, very generous amount of bacon, and the bacon was almost like pork scratchings, like like you know, crackling on pork. Well, but yeah, that's it. There's only so much sauce a napkin can take. One sheet, does plenty. But I really rate the burger, and you know it's good ingredients too. All the ingredients, you know what's in it. And you can see the thickness of the patty there. <laughs> And they put like special seasoning inside. Special seasoning in there. Do we know? Do we know what it's in? No, there? is that like? No, is that, no, is that no, the no, secret no, no, sauce? No, no, no. I don't even think Tom knows what it is, but it's banging. It's a shame it's just took us like four hours to get. I mean, even without traffic, it would have taken like even if we didn't stop, it would have taken like three and a half hours. But even then, there's so many times I'm like, oh, do I do it? Do I do it? But it's like I had the idea, and I was like, yeah, fuck it, I'm gonna come try this burger. I'll probably buy some meat here as well and take it home. This sounds really like I'm on the sex offender list, but I might have to use a knife and fork. Check his hard drive. Look at that, man. I'm going to pick up this brand new GoPro I just got yesterday. It's going to be greasy as <laughs> Sorry, can I get more napkins? Yeah, thank you. Uh, there's a baby being over her eating. This coleslaw and wedgie combo is good. Oh, yeah, I'm curious as to how much this is going to be. The syndicate doesn't make any money off it, you know? Thank you. That coleslaw is really good. Red cabbage, I think. Maybe it's your turn. Mate, this feels hot. Can you see the difference in lighting though? It's crazy. That's what I'm saying. It's messy, that's big, it's thick. That's what you want. You just have to get stuck in, Shan. Make sure you actually get a burger, a bite of the burger. Like, look, look, look. What do you do without any mess? I need to take smaller bites. Really good, yeah. Really nice, thick. Proper legit protein. Oh, mate, why is that so. Oh, did you see that bun folding at all? No. I love how they made the sauce come out it's like a volcano. Well, at least they actually have it. Mm. I like that one, it's a little bit pink. Oh, mate. On this channel, when I say ah, oh, mate, it tends to be a good thing. Shits on like a Mackey's burger or whatever, you know. Because obviously, this isn't like fast food, it's like proper. The amount of bacon you get as well. Mate, this is filling up. I feel like an animal, ain't it? Like the beef and bacon are really nice, Skiller. Do I shove the whole thing in my mouth? Do I shove the whole thing in my mouth? Alright, uh, So it's hard to make that bacon here in the UK, though. You know, I'm, I'm, uh, that American bacon. Very nice. Very nice indeed. That was really good. Yeah, that was really good, man. Quality of it as well was really good. I had to stop the GoPro because it was piping hot. I didn't want a GoPro to explode after just buying it the previous day, so. Alright, I'll have a bite of your toasty then. Fine, keep banging on about it. That looks sick. I'm just trying to breathe after that monstrosity of a burger. You know, just for gains or even bulking or whatever, just you knowing you get that a certain quality. Like, you don't know what's in a McDonald's burger. But here, you know it's from, well, I don't know if they have animals around here and they kill them, but I don't know how it works, but yeah. Proper quality meat. So Butchers is literally just on the other side. Oh, mate. That's good. That's really good. They don't just give you a slice of ham. <coughs> like Starbucks and Costa do. Around me, it's just like squires, but like, I don't think we have a lime field. Just squires, like they don't have a butcher's. It's probably so much better than squires. Yeah. That bun though looked really good. Salad in a toasted. Yo, filthy pervert. When do you go to a garden centre and get that quality, like a butcher's patty? That burger was pretty good. Nice little collection of tissues there. Oh, look at this meat, man. We're gonna have to get something. You can just get stir fry. That's sick. I'm gonna have to get something here, chef. All right, we're out. As you can see it looks fucking lovely around here, mate. I was thinking, I might just bumped into Tom. That'd be jokes. I'd be like, mate, by the way, I've come down to try your burger. But yeah, the burger's really nice. The thickness, everything. Here's some sheep. I don't know why I'm showing you. Wow. Bash. Bash. 
I feel autistic sometimes when I'm just <laughs> when I'm just recording and vlogging. I just feel autistic. Very nice place, nice people. What, what did you say, Amy? What oh, I nearly left my chicken. By the way, I got. I was told by, by the boss man it'd be about four, but because the breasts are so thick, I know it sounds nuts. I got one of each. I think it's one salt and pepper chicken, but the peri peri looks good, and there's like jerk. The full big fat chicken breasts. Each breast, I say, it's got to be at least 40, 40 grams of protein. And the Don that was in the video, I don't know why I didn't mention, oh yeah, I saw you in the video, I don't know why, just still learning to like get more confident recording and stuff. But yeah, he was in the video, he actually served me getting these stuff in the little butcher section. But I was saying, everything's so thick there, the meat. It'd be so good, just again, like the quality's good enough anyway, like by the looks of it, it's butchers, good quality, the area, whatever. The thickness of the food is insane, so you're getting more protein anyway. Even that something like the crisp was nice. Yeah. But it's so basic, like the crisp. And you so said nice. that it was, um, everyone was nice in that. No, everyone's really nice. Yeah. yeah. Now we got to drive back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so next day after that clip, it's about five o'clock. I'll be editing for about seven or eight hours, kind of on and off, but for the most part of them hours, I've been editing. Still got to export and upload the video. Just going to get it out today. It just feels right on Monday. But yeah, I look back and it was well worth it, man. Like, I just, you know, I'm happy with how the GoPro footage went. I'm happy with, I mean, the fact that we got there and they had the burger was great. The burger was really nice. Happy that my sister was able to come along to help record and stuff like that. Because, you know, it's a lot of commitment just to come with me to go to Manchester for a burger. You know, it sounds nuts to a lot of people. It just made sense. I'm hoping Tom might have actually seen this because he did see that I tweeted it about it last night. And he said, yeah, what a bloke. This is the tweet here. He's like, hey, yeah, what a bloke. He's like, no way. He was quite gassed. So hopefully he might watch this. He might be watching it right now. I don't know. But either way, very nice burger. Very good choice of things in there. Shout out to... Uh, I was about to call it Rygate again. Limefield. Rygate? What the fuck? I didn't even call it Rygate. What the fuck? Limefield. Very good food you got there. I haven't had the chicken breasts yet, but I will do a video on them chicken breasts at some point. That'll be another separate video. Still getting used to this GoPro, guys. So just bear with. But yeah, more videos like this, bigger, better videos. You know, this, even just doing this videos. Like, I think I've got like three or four kind of video ideas. I'm happy I did it. Thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications. Dreams to become a YouTuber. It's still been the dream. On and off throughout the years, but now I'm like really committed the past like two, three years. Well, saying that after uploading about three videos this year. And I've been growing, but nothing crazy, but I'm just waiting for that. That breakthrough, because this was really my passion and I love doing it. It's just like, bro, life's too short. We're on this little fucking rock floating through space. Do whatever the fuck you want. So, thank you for watching. And Tom, keep doing the vlogs. Absolutely fucking love them. I love just like, just watching your family do stuff. I feel like I'm a part of your family, weirdly. I know a lot of people say that. It, it really does feel like that, man. Yeah, just everything you capture, like, it's all real. It's all legit. It's not fake. You record everything. Everything's legit. I love that you have the freedom to do whatever the fuck you want. And that's also inspiring, especially like when you go abroad like whoever or wherever it's so inspiring man what you see is literally what happened it's just yeah really interesting watching for a while enough arse licking thank you for watching and bye bye